Hello and welcome to the Tarkus Zone. Thank you for joining me. Today we're going to be doing episode two of uh, this Wrath 2 game. I think it's Asgar's Wrath 2. If you watch my previous video, I came off as really not knowing what I would, hell I was doing. And that is still true today. I have not played any more of the game outside of what I showed you the last time. So I'm like a child with this game. I know nothing about it. I didn't play the previous game. But what I love so far about this game is its graphics, its storyline. It, it just seems to be buttoned and packaged up very well. Now, this game came free with a MetaQuest 3 headset I bought. It was a package deal. It, it was like, buy the headset today, get your game free. Well, the game didn't release, I think, until like uh, December uh, 22nd. We're going to have some guy jump out at us here. Yeah, okay, well, not so much jumping. They're just doing this so that we recalibrate the uh the system uh and then we're going to hit a to continue here it's down there at the very bottom now so we're going to go back into where we left off last time like i said i haven't done anything more with this game and um we're back into the sanctuary area with these witches i guess you is what you call them we got to go back through this portal I'm just moving forward. It might not it might not seem it because I'm not like kind of like bouncing like a human would. I was like almost gliding, but I was moving forward. So with this here is we're just moving forward with what they want us to do to understand the game. So you gotta grab my sword. This thing's pretty cool. And then you just hit these walls. Alright. Okay, grab the ring. Um alright, grab the ring. What am I supposed to do? Oh, it just moves me forward. Okay. So I think I'm supposed to go over where that eye is. What's this over here? I mean, just the texturing alone is, is pretty cool. Oh. I'll take that. Okay. That, that worked well. I mean, just the atmosphere, the sound... All right, what's over there? I don't want to miss out on anything. Out of reach, of course. <sighs> you but just these parkour. of power feel connected to it. Like if I just reach out. Okay. And quickly pull. Oh, got up. It's like, Tarkas, read the instructions. And okay. Still not the greatest surprise today. All right. So I guess I'm going to have to... In hand. Nice. Gotta grab my sword again. Probably hit. No. Oh, I gotta go over there. I like the dashing. You know, you can dash out of. Oh, I'm exhausted. It. Because down here at the bottom, it tells me what my stamina or energy is. So I use anytime I do the dash, it uses that up. Oh, let's put that in there. Still control this mortal. Oh, did not work. Oh, I just have to hold it. I thought I had to put it in there. Just had to magically just hold on the to key it. Key to freedom. I wonder how I end up paying for it. Holy crap! Is that well done? Oh, that is well. I mean, it's just amazing and how much, how much they've done with this technology. Better up than down. It just gives you hope uh, of what if, what could be possible with this technology. Okay, is this a crate I can get into? No. All right, I guess I'm going into this way. I don't want to miss anything. Ooh, get my sword out. Oh, I bet you this is the Shouldn't portal that allows me. I have me... no quarrel with you. Oh, is it possible? I can see where they are. Just a strike or two to its weak point. It be dead in no time. Yeah, I like how you can just use the terrain to to protect you. Oh, it looks like they drop loot too. Okay, let me get rid of my sword. Here. Okay. Oh, that's cool as hell. Okay, I want my. 
Okay, how do I get to that? Oh, okay. So it's the bottom trigger, like just like a pull up. So it's not the top trigger, it's the bottom trigger, okay. All right, throw your weapon to activate the... Oh, I guess they better aim at the switch, right? Damn it, Tarkus, you're such a dumb... I like how the weapon comes back to you after a certain amount of time. So you don't have to, you know, like other games is not like that. Other games they played that you had weapons, you had to actually go pick them up or you left them behind. And I like the fact that that doesn't happen in the game. That's just a pain in the ass that doesn't need to be a pain in the ass. Even the damn basket, look at that. Can I open that? Nope, can't move that. Man, look at this. Oh. I was gonna say, I thought I heard something coming out behind me. Ugh. Oh, I can burn myself? No, no way. Ah. Oh shit, I can kill myself on the fire. That's like unheard of in a game. You know what I mean? To think that up. I took that much damage by putting my hands in the fire. Oh wow, look at this room. That lever across the gap. Okay. Find a way to get over there. Well, obviously, it's not going to be just as easy as... Well, maybe it's just as easy as jumping down here? Oh, I can't... Oh, it won't let me jump down. It's like almost like there's an invisible railing right here. So i got to figure out a way to get over there. Oh, I'm going to have to parkour it across this. Right? Whoa! Yeah. Oh. Okay. Here we go. You are the only one that can sting. Woohoo! Woohoo! <laughs> I, like, I like that. Uh, I like how the combat works. I'm actually, you're probably wondering what, what I'm doing actually in my house. I'm sitting in a chair, my gaming chair, and it uh, allows me just to. Uh, you know, move around in a, it's a swivel chair. Now, objects around me so I could swing as well. So I am able to play this game while sitting down, which is not my preferable option for games like this. I'd like to be standing up. It's just that my, I've only got so many rooms that I can actually do this in. And the room where I would normally stand up is occupied right now with my wife working in her office is like near that. So I can imagine her having patience with me of being in the room next to her, you know, you know, making all sorts of noise and swinging. And get ready. Get ready for what? Oh. Okay, I guess those things are dropping items too. I guess I should have picked those up because there's no auto loot. So I've got to go back up there, I think. Whoop. Even, even going up the uh, the ladder, Whoop. even going up the ladder is pretty cool. I should be able to just toss myself down. There we go. So I'm supposed to go over here because I see this. Oh, is this like a medical? Okay, so I have to access L. Okay to access my belt. Okay. I wonder what they meant by L because we got X and Y. Whoop. Whoop. Oh, I, got, I went into the map. I'm trying to locate the... I guess that's B. I don't know what L... So that would be... Because this is my left hand. That's my weapon. That's the other weapon. Come on, Tarkus, don't be a dumbass. It's gotta be a, I'll eventually figure it out. But there's obviously a belt option that, and it said just hit L. All right, all right, we'll just move on here. Okay, so I guess I should have run across that one to get over there. But then I wanted to be able to get the little, that is cool as hell too. How much hit points do I have? Yeah, I don't wanna be, uh, put my chin in the fire there if I only got a few hit points left. So we'll go back up here. Oh, I gotta get used to the, the ladder. So 
so it's got to be a jump. Yep. Oh man, that's amazing. Okay, press A. All right. I mean, let me just look down on these controllers. I don't think there's an L. I mean, it's been a while since I played VR, and I haven't like memorized all the buttons. But I didn't think there was just a drag. Oh, that's neat. Okay, so I need to go in that direction, but there's a wall there, so it looks like I gotta go back this way. All right. I'm not really sure how I get over there to that. This doesn't look like there's a door. This is the door. This has gotta be the door here. Oh yeah. Man, that's amazing. Oh, I can smash these. Oh, I can't smash this one. Come on, come on. Can I smash the fire? All right. All right. Did the gods really think this would slow me down? What the hell? Oh, so these were traps. I, I sprung them. So it started this nonsense. Look at that. All right, so I want to go in this direction, right? Get into here. Oh, there's another one of those. Okay, so it says click and hold L to access your... your uh, oh, I bet you this is... Okay, that's the re... Okay. That's it right there. Okay, I found it. <laughs> Just had to remember what. I'm like, it's gotta be one of these inserted buttons. Okay, so this allows you to go to your inventory. All right, right hand, left hand. Uh, what else? These things here show that I, I haven't even played around with those options yet. All right, so this is okay these are the where the healing potions are so we can come here anytime and, and scarf down a healing potion okay so that's really the it that's the inventory system oh, okay so the actual belt where they said hit l am i gonna back into that thing all right where they actually said hit l it's the toggle it's the uh it's the um toggle button that you hold this down and this brings you to your belt. So this is a quick way to get to those healing potions. And this button here below the toggle just brings you into the inventory system, which is over here. So I should be able to put these in my belt, right? So I should be able to, oh yeah. So I should be able to move those into belt one. So how do I do that? So I should be able to grab a hold of those. I need to get them over there somehow. Oh, did I take one? No. So how do I get you guys to go over there? Okay, yeah. How do I put you over? Oh, there it is. Oh, okay. So it's the bottom, the bottom trigger on your controller grabs a hold of items. Just like when you pick up items off the ground to loot them, the bottom trigger allows you to move those over to the belt. So now, now that it's in the bell, if I push down the, the, that toggle button, there it is for quick use if I need to quick do it. All right, I'm starting to understand this game. It's just, like I said, it's been a while since I played VR, uh, you know, and I haven't memorized every single button, even though you're probably saying to yourself, yo dumbass is what? two upper buttons, a two sunken buttons, uh, you know, and then the toggle button. So it can't be that complicated. <laughs> you just, <laughs> oh, that is cool as hell. Imagine getting, getting caught up by that thing. All right. Oh, I got to parkour this. All right, parkour time. Oh, don't, don't mess around with that. Look at those spikes. Okay, I gotta parkour this, but I gotta time it with that over there. With so I don't get eaten by that. Your own strength 
becomes his. Divine protection. Collect divine protection by hitting the crystal. Ooh, 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 I'm hitting it. I'm hitting it. Am I not doing it right? <laughs> okay, I gotta hit it harder. But you'll get a taste of what he needs. I was like survive. giving it some love taps. To survive. And then I they really wanted me to really hit it. Okay, so now I gotta grab this bad boy. I love that throwing weapon. That thing's cool as hell. Alright, so now I go. These are down, so I'm gonna go forward. Yep, there we go. Alright. So I like to peek my head in because that's. I like to be a little cautious here with their. Okay, here's something alive. Oh man. These things are a pain in the ass. Oh. I hear another one. Oh, I hear another one. Oh, two of them. Oh, I missed him. Oh, cool. I I tried throwing when that. Will they learn? Well, I got it. Right? There's no more baddies. Pick these up. These are mine. So I tried, instead of using the sword, I grabbed this, uh, this one over here. And I just, and what's nice is you can do it with either hand. And even if it's there, you can still pull it from your belt. So you don't have to pull, go up there to get it. Just do that. So I just got to get better at that, that. And then you've got this. So I can double I can double do it too now. So, I mean, I'm just gotta get used to this game, but this is, this is amazing. So you can be fighting and then go, Ooh, and then just pull it back out. Like Thor, you know, or actually like uh, Wolfgar there in D&D uh, &D there, uh, had the, the hammer coming back to him kind of thing. I wonder if I can throw that. Oh, I even can throw the sword. Okay. Oh yeah, that is cool. All right, yeah, I'm really like it. Just like that other. Door. I'm really liking this Does game. Does it open the same way? Oh yeah. Aha! All right, we're back on another elevator. All right. I think we were here once now. This the is gods uh, never do small, do they? Alright. And what is that strange altar? Show the mortal who you are. Who you are. You must approach the god altar. Yeah, I'm uh, once I'm gonna take this all in first. On the altar. Okay. On the altar. Yeah, I'll do that in a second. You'll return to your godly form. You haven't forgotten already, have you? No, I gotta take all this in. Look at that. Look at that uh, sand. Like, the sand is coming down and filling this down here. And it's all sand moving. Look at it. It's coming from everywhere. Man, they just think this sh How do they think this shit up? That's neat as hell. Like this, this god or whatever is is just dumping the sand out. Oh, it looks like there's a box up there that I can get. So let's see if I can get up there. Okay. Okay, that's not what I want to do. I can see a glowing. All right, so that is connected to that cable. No. You can see that this lifts. So because there's a crate up there, but I can't parkour up there. It won't let me parkour up up there, so I'm not really sure how I cause that let that system to to there's another chest over there too. On the top of that one. And it looks like there's a line there too, so I'm not really sure. I don't have some sort of Spider-Man thing to get me up there, so I'm not really sure how you get up there. 
All right, so I guess that would be something that I'll have to think about later. Uh, let me just do what they're asking me to do here. Okay, so I'm back in my God form. Oh, it says hold Y. Okay, that would be, this is Y, right? Oh! Does it feel new again? You remember. Okay. It hasn't been long. Oh, this is cool. So I guess in this form, that's how I get this to work. With it. You'll divide the path forward and see what can't be seen. Uh oh, look at that. Oh, I knew that did something. You cleared a path for me, but I can hardly move to climb it. Your mortal will wander off without you. He won't, but you need him still. All right, so I need to get back to my other form. I gotta get back to possess this guy down here. Hey, buddy, how's it going? All right. You're back. You do need me after all. We're partners in the escape, it seems. All right. Ugh. So there's crates here. I can't get into those. Do I pull that now or do I go back over to that one first? Let me go over to that one first. Huh. Huh. You got this. Oh, okay. So that that chain over there controls the height of that one. So I, yeah, I guess I just should just follow what they're asking me to do. And you know, there's a lot of games where you gotta find these little secret things. And but you know, this one's kind of like their secret, but there you just gotta follow the instructions. Oh no, that's moving the god. You can move great objects, but not a mere pulley. You must be a god. Who else would have such power and such limitations? Yeah, I got a lot of limitations. You got you, you uh, got Tarkus at the wheel. You've your brother Atum, but he still won't give you a path out. How do I still get over For there? Him, it's all new and strange. Return to your godly form. If you want. All right, I guess I'll go back up. to my godly form. Maybe I'm not the only one who's angered the gods. Okay, so I hold Y to get back to there. And then this god here. Okay, so I know how to do that. That brings me back to the portal. These are the weights. So is this what I gotta do? Or is this like a puzzle? All right, Tarkus, what am I doing now? Okay, hold Y. Okay. Oh, I'm back over here. All right, let me just go down. We go over here first. Okay, I went to where they're asking me to go. And then they said, go to my... And they said, go to my... Um, okay, that's the bell. Go to my god form. Do I have to take these again? Looks like I gotta take these again. Maybe put them over here? Ah, managed to. Well, that was it? That's how simple it was? Oh, I've got to get all three of these glowing. Okay, so this is like a puzzle game? Okay, that's the blues. Right, so I got. I think I've got to get this red. I get. Oh, there's another. All right, there's another one right there. There's more down. Oh, look at this big bastard. Look at that. Okay, so I guess it just comes down to making this um, better still. 
Oh, that did it. See, they're all glow. Oh, while well, they, they're glowing. Did I do what I was supposed to do? Maybe I gotta put this over here first. Oh yeah, they're all, yeah, they're grab all, uh... all right, so I grab a hold of this. Oh, and it opened the door down there. So now I just go back to my, oh, it's going to be a cutscene. Oh, what the hell? No way. What the? Oh man, enemies attack to parry. Yeah, I get that. All right, you scoundrel. Practice. Oh, you broke the weapon? Oh, it knocks the weapon away. Okay, parry blue suit attacks down enemies. Grab where the weapon holds her. Quickly pick it up. Back up. But I can't move. I'm stuck in this spot. Okay, signature attacks. Disarm you if your weapon is not moving. Oh, it's got to be moving on impact. Okay. So it's actually got to be moving to keep the weapon in my hand. Okay. Okay, that makes sense. So you've got to actually parry while moving. If you just do, if you just hold it, you're going to get it knocked out of your hand. Oh. oh, I can move now. Cool. Come on. Oh, I like this. Yeah, I just... Oh, I just cut his head off. I just cut his arm off. That's cool. Oh, I cut that guy in half. Felt your strength. You have no love of set either, oh, I take I'll it. Pick these up. I'm gonna need those for something. Even though uh, I don't know what it's gonna be for. Okay, that, that was cool. I, I have to say I, that was really neat, especially the fact they cutting their heads off, their arms off, and the, in the, uh, the whole thought process of you know, if you're holding it like this, you're gonna get disarmed. But if you're moving it, you're gonna hold on to the weapon. But even if you get disarmed, you just grab back to the belt. And so you're gonna lose a second in combat because you're gonna to have to grab it from the belt. And I gotta use this weapon more too. So I could have been throwing them and grabbing them and yeah. All right. All right, folks, I think before we go into this elevator, actually, let's go into this elevator and get to the next section. So I think what it is is when we see those pools form, when they form themselves, it's like a save. It's like, you know, this is where you're saved to at this point. So maybe I need to get to the next one of those before I stop the video. Uh, right here. The gods taught me with such riches. So basically, this is your like your save. Uh, this is where I can come back to when I'm is my thoughts. I think they told me I was to destroy it. Oh. Okay, maybe. Okay, that's just the shield. So that is not. Maybe it's the save. Uh, in the sh it, it looks like it added to my shield by doing that. So I got to destroy these. I got to remember that they told me to do that earlier. All right, this room looks cool. This looks like a parkour room. This, oh, look at the stuff down there. There's a there's a healing vial down there. There's some sort of uh, mummified person down there. So eventually I guess I gotta get down there. Uh, but it also looks like I gotta parkour all this. All right, well, this looks amazing. I think I'm good to stop here. I think the game will put me back here without me having to do all this over again, would be my thought. I don't think there's an actual save. Let's go back to this menu and see. I mean, there's a lot going on here. Oh man, this is a, amazing. Just this game's got so much complexity and it's just that Tarkus needs to remember all the little complexity stuff. You know, he's gotta first remember what the hell the button is on the key, what left means, what like, I'm sorry about that, folks. Like I said, I don't play VR all that often anymore, and 
eventually it just becomes second nature. You don't care what buttons they are. You just know what buttons to hit, right? I mean, it's like riding a bike when you eventually get it is, you know, the buttons just work and you don't really consciously think, oh, that's the X or the Y or the left. It just, you just simply get it done. All right, well, thank you for joining me. Appreciate you watching my videos. And this has been the Tarkus Zone.